I was working. Hello. All right. So third attempt at recording this. We're done trying to stream it because that just was not working at all, guys. So this is literally my third new game. Um, I was playing with the volume, trying to get everything right and everything up and running. Anyways, this game came out today called Zucosis Rescue the Animals. And um, I know I don't upload videos very often, but I could not for the life of me get this one to stream. So we're going to go ahead and record this and upload it and see how this goes. Hopefully you guys enjoy this game. I've waited patiently for this game to come out. I know y'all don't want to hear me talk, so we're going to go ahead and hop into this, guys. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this gameplay as much as I do. And Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Oh, we didn't go in the trash. Excellent. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Ever thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo? <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? He'll find out later. Oh, are you finally awake? Good, get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Okay, so now since we can officially play this game, guys. Jeez, oh, Jeez, oh, it's quite spacious here. Yep, this is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now, we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Load two herbal and one vegetable breaks onto the bridge. Okay, let's do that. Not like I haven't done this already, right? Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Alright. And here's our K-A-T-I-E. Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Aboard! Now, select the giraffe enclosure on the control panel and start the train. Alright, activate the lever to load the brick trolley. Okay, go to the, gir the giraffe station. What? Wait, I was trying to figure out how to start the train. Oh, giraffe station. Fasten your seat belts and sit up straight. Let's go. So we're at the giraffe station. Now listen carefully, I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. 
Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Follow me. All right. This is our kitchen it. factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. The <laughs> zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay. You need to select the giraffe from the list. So herbal, 3.5 grams. Vegetable, 1.5 grams. Oh, that's how much we got. Let's cook it. Click on the cut to slice the herbs, okay? Uh, Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. Okay, so now what? It's not enough, Paul. Add more. Excellent, Paul. In the box. Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Go ahead. Uh, all right. Um. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. Okay. All right. Well, we're not supposed to press the accept button to finish. Okay. Perfect. Oh now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Activate the lever. Okay, so what 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 lever? I am really sorry, guys. I am I am trying to figure this out. Um, activate the lever to activate the trolley. Oh, gadget trolley. Now drag the trolley to the gates. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It it's is. our pride. You don't Very see anything cool. like it in others. Pride? Then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. This is the entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Poster. You know it, so there's no... what? Okay, what? Scars, zucosis. Um, so scars, I need to carefully examine the bodies of the animals for scars. Scars indicate that something is wrong with the animals, with the animal. Um, I have to observe the behavior of the animals. Zucosis can, be, can manifest itself in strange actions and weird movements of animals. Uh, deviation from the recipe. If you deviate too much from the recipe, the animals might get sick. The risk isn't very high, but it's the best not to break the recipe. Activate the terminal and enter the enclosure. So. Draft. Um. Symptom map. Before leaving, make sure that all symptoms are detected. All right, y'all. Sorry, I had to deal with something. Um, anyways, so before leaving, make sure that the symptoms are detected. Open enclosure. Here we are in the enclosure. Now we need to feed our little creatures. Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Leo, Bo. Bo.
Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile fecal extractor. Okay. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I don't know. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Right, put, Come uh, on, Paul. <laughs> Don't chicken out. Alright, so is this the MFE right here? Alright, so... TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. The thermal imager. Take the TIS. Alright, so the TIS. Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Too. As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperalax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit and closure button. Okay. So, we're gonna go ahead and press the... In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected in this enclosure. Click on the exit and closure button. All right, take the trolley back. Do I have to make some medications too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn, how do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. We got kicked out in the first year. No worries, that should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. 
Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. so jumpy. Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever oh. inside the car. Alright, you did scare me, but not that, that was bad. Excellent. Now this is our mobile vet station. To make Temporalax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum. There are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Alright, so... Okay, so... what? Find a Temporalax from the list. Alright, um... Click on the button to create Temporalax. Hey, you said you did it. Perfect. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Alright, and um... Oh, right here. Cool, you've got Temporalax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. In the gadget trolley. Okay, so... Nice! So apparently you can't aim it at him. Alright, now what? Take the vet gun and load it with the Temporalax using the... Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Shoot the giraffe with a high temperature. I don't remember who it was. The sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful. Don't confuse Bo with Poe. <laughs> oh my god. I don't remember. Oh no. Alright, well let's find out which giraffe. Cause this could end the wrong way if I shoot the wrong giraffe. Who's the sick one? Oh dear god, please. Poe. Poe is the sick one, okay. smoothly yes, seems sir. like it I did this for the first time hopefully he'll get better soon well don't doubt that we need to get back to the hub return to the hub because we love the hub right Okay, well you tell me 
Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Is that your wife? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't mess up. Are you just gonna leave her out there waiting? What's wrong with you, dude? here who knows how long ago you're not answering calls i'm worried Oi. lily sweetheart sorry didn't hear you right away everything's okay they put me on probation but i had to start immediately you should just go home i'll be back in the morning and tell you everything paul but i saw them lock you up it's not normal yeah it's just protocol here they took away my phone and made me sign an nda and all i have to do is feed and treat the animals Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Okay, um, put a meat break for Lily and... Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time right, for me to work. Task complete. So let's go ahead and read what the other ones say. Uh, so we got scars, deviation, treat animals. It seems the job is harder than I thought. Do I have to make some meds? Uh, scatter gadgets. Probably I will need all of these things for work. I wonder what will happen if I apply them not just on animals. Wait. I will need all these things for work. I wonder what will happen. Okay, so it seems I'll have to manually record the symptoms of zucosis, scars, and mucus. Good food. I need to give some meat to my wife. We've been eating all we've been eating eating only prepackaged meals for almost a year now. It's terrible for our little Gina. Okay. So this tells you what we need for each place. 
So we got penguins, so they need fish. Elephants are gonna need uh, that. Giraffes are gonna need that. Gorilla's gonna need that. Hippo's gonna need that. Moose is gonna need that. Wallaby needs that. Zebra needs that. Okay, so we're good. So the only guy that needs fish is just a uh, uh, penguin. All right, what's going on in here? That's his boss is gone. Sorry, scary thing. I'm trying to leave you out. Um. All right. So, what's the objective here? Check the enclosure, feed the animals, collect analysis, measure the temperature, measure the sound, submit blood for analysis, submit feces for analysis. Okay, so. You know what? Because I don't know what we're going to need for all the animals, so let's just go ahead and grab everything. Alright. We're just going to prepare ourselves, y'all. Yeah. 
abandoned trolley. I removed all the trolleys, so we're gonna have to go get more. So I'm already screwing up, y'all. Don't do that bad. Grab the trolley. Okay, there we go. Head back to the wallabies. And I see how we can do it. Hello? Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am, this doesn't feel right. Paul, I'm begging you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. No, you won't call back. Nine, 1768. All right, so new task added. Um, apparently, I'm responsible for... I'm not sure if I should help this woman. I already have enough problems as it is. Recipes in the cold room. Put a poster with a list of recipes uh, for animals in the cold room. Good food.
confused. Alright, so, um, yeah. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna 
didn't get Sally's blood, but I'm, it seemed okay. So it has something to do with their wound. Rotaviruses are a group of viruses that cause gas cannot with something. Symptoms include diarrhea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Okay, so... substance which for treatments of acute respiratory viral infections rotavirus I'm not sure which one to make y'all uh, substance for treatment of allergic manifestation substance for treatment of blood disease substance for treatment of infections caused by the bacterial base substance for something normalization infest care uh, substance based on that bitch penny you might die i don't know which one you need based on plant extracts for a streets of okay. substance for the treatment of that uh for treatment of meningitis Treatment of migraines, treatment of severe conditions caused by something, plague, rotocare, oh wait, what was it called? Rotoviruses. Rotocare. Treatment of rotovirus infection. Create. Honey, you might just live. You might just live. And I know you did not just call me a liar. You call me a liar. Slowing up. It's on my second animal crate. And apparently, I'm supposed to be checking on someone's husband. Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called, looking for someone named CJ, searching for her husband. That bitch again. Although CJ's no saint either, always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab, and we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. 
Excellent. I'll call you later. I mean, at Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Yes. Oh, I definitely do. I thought you had beef or, uh, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long neck pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they turn into... How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the... What the hell is the mother? <laughs> oh, by the way. <laughs> I see why that's an option now. <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? <laughs> Sorry, Paul, but it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way, descending to simple theft. There won't be any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul, you won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. Uh, sounds like I'm in prison here. You are. Look at what's going on. Right, look, look at this toilet. Um...
Shim Factory. Feed them. Summers experiment 23 testing experiment uh, experimental meds on mutated specimens they don't work during the frustration phase the pathological called division process must be completed in other words the organism must fully mutate access to experimental drug is located at the vet station There's another locker we can access, and another locker we can access, and my locker we can access. I guarantee if you fail, they grind you up. Man. There's multiple endings, so. Anyways, guys, this is to be continued for another video. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed. Bye.